Software projects don't get delivered. Most die before they get to see any use at all. Most code doesn't get delivered. It gets written and thrown away. And only a very few number of products actually dominate the market. So making relevant software is difficult. And there's reasons for this. The main reason is that problems we don't, they actually are hidden until we get quite close. Unless the business is very well known and not changing, if the business is new, if we're trying to, for example, make a, you know, a video game, we're making a video game, and as we start developing it, we realize what the user really wants. But almost as we get close to the use, we can see the real problems. Try and design it up front only works if it's our second, third, or fourth version of this particular game. And the more we make up front, the harder it is to move to where the problems really are. And then we attach to the solutions that we've made. We're like, yes, but I'm, I'm such a specialist in this particular solution, I want to stay there. And we get, get blind to the real problems. This is an example of a Belgian beer. It's the one I like best. It's, a, it's taken the monks that make this maybe... 200 years to develop this beer. That's what they do. They make this one beer. And it's the best beer in Belgium, and you can barely buy it anymore. Orval is very rare. This is the result of constant refinement of everything, the bottle, the label, the lettering, the, the amount of hops in the beer, just absolutely perfect. So perfection takes a long time. You can get there. Simplicity is the key. So one of the ways we work is we try to remove problems rather than add features, which is a way of looking at how we design software. Identify really important problems, solve them in the simplest possible way, and then move on to the next one. So rather than saying we want to add this feature and this feature and this feature, we say what are the problems that we have? It may be too slow. It may be too big. It may need, may be able to, you know, this particular chain of work is taking too much effort. Let's make that faster. So if you look at a, a mobile phone, a smartphone now today, what's the biggest problem? 